this is Natalia from the Fiercely Independent Network. We are at the Bearsville Theater for the My So-Called Selfish Life film screening. Fuck off, Teresa. I do not want cats. <laughs> It is basically a film about people who decide not to have children. But on a different level, it looks at why is that choice so stigmatized? Why is there so much pressure on women to have children? The millennia, many millennia long idea that women's purpose on this earth is to make babies, um, and why that, there's a problem <laughs> with that assumption. It's a personal topic for me. Uh, in person because I made that decision to, to not have children. It's really the first time that I've seen a film um, like this. Yeah, I think it was very well written, I thought. Adding the humor element kept it light, not a very serious subject. You know, every community, every movement has a spectrum of understanding and feeling around these issues. So I get called a, um, a parent pleaser, a breeder pleaser, excuse me. I have been called a breeder pleaser, which I think is a T-shirt, really. <laughs> I feel like some of my colleagues in Europe can't believe that American filmmakers will just start making a movie and just think, well, the funding is going to come from somewhere that I have to start working on this, and I'm just going to figure out how to do it. But that is, to me, the independent spirit, where you have a story to tell, and you're just going to figure out how to tell it, no matter what. For more from the Fiercely Independent Network and to learn more about the festival, visit www.woodstockfilmfestival.com.